Hello. I am very pleased to announce to you today that we have added some new functionality to our My Ocean uh, data visualization portal that's on our Copernicus Marine website. And this portal allows you to dive in and explore our catalog of hundreds of variables um, through time, so in the past, in the present, in the future, and through depth. So let's get started to look at the new features which allow you to download a video animation, image, share a link to the um, parameters that you picked, or embed that in another website. So I'll get started by clicking on this blue Add Layer button. This will allow me to browse through our catalog and uh, pick the variables I want to add. So I personally am interested in the physical attributes of the ocean. So I'm going to look under blue ocean. Blue uh, ocean, just like it might sound, represents um, things like sea level, currents, and other physical attributes. White ocean is sea ice, and green ocean represents biogeochemical parameters. So I'm going to pick this first product, our global physical analysis with a uh, forecast and add it to my map. Now this model has many uh, variables inside of it. So I am going to pick seawater velocity, for example, because I think it's really interesting to look at how water moves over a short period of time. Now I can click out of this to see it on my map. Now this viewing tool allows you to superimpose different um, variables on top of each other with this um, uh, opacity slide. So I'm going to put this on full opacity so I can really see the seawater velocity. So you can see I have it visible and selected here on uh, my viewer. Now I'm going to go to the share button which allows me to copy a tiny URL and share that on in an email exchange, social media, or what have you. Under image, I can download this image with the uh, caption and legend, which then um, you, all users are welcome to use um, without uh, royalties. So this is uh, free and open data, so you can publish this anywhere, of course, uh, giving us credit. As you can see here, we have a watermark, which allows this uh, which allows this image to be um, traced later and uh, know that it comes from our service. Next, we have the video option. Now, I'm going to make a short video. Uh, we are November 17th, so I think it'd be interesting to, interesting to get a little bit of a hindcast data from the past. So I'll start on November 13th. There is a uh, drop-down calendar, or you can type it in here. Um, then I will pick the end date. I'm uh, going to pick a little bit of a forecast. So I will go up to the 20th of November, which again, you can pick through a calendar or type it in in this box. So um, then under step, you can pick how much data you want in this uh, video. Um, so this video is not too heavy. I'm gonna pick it by day and not hour. I would like an MP4, and I will um, add the legend and caption. I will generate the video. Now, this is uh, interesting because we can either generate the video and uh, just watch it through this portal, or you have the option to also download the video. Again, all these, um, uh, all all this information you find on our website is free and open, so feel free to publish this or use this as you would like for your purposes. So now that our video is generated, I can watch it here in the portal, or I can download it by clicking the download button. I will download it here and it will go to my browser download fo folder, my uh, download folder, which can be accessed through the browser. Lastly, you can embed your selection within our portal. So um, here I can uh, copy this, which comes as an iframe, which you can put this in your HTML code 
to uh, into a web page, which means that this will be a um, embedded on a website, and you can share it um, as you like. So thanks for watching this short tutorial, and uh, stay tuned for upcoming tutorials where we will explain more about this tool and many other tools and services within our uh, Copernicus Marine Service. All right, thank you and have a nice day.